Hello, this is Melissa, the insurance exam queen, and we are here on this channel to help you pass your insurance exam with ease and confidence. In this video, we're going to talk about the insurance director or the director of insurance, commissioner of insurance, and explain some rules and roles that he has so that you can help make sure that you ace your exam on the state law section. Before we jump into that, please make sure to subscribe to the channel, like this video. You can also drop a comment below about what test you are taking what exam, uh, what exam you're taking and what state you're in. And I will tell you what is important. Now, keep in mind, my YouTube videos are amazing, but they are just a snack. If you want the full meal, you got to go check me out at insuranceexamqueen.com where we can get you enrolled in my supplemental class series videos that will help you understand the content that you are trying to learn to be able to pass this exam. We have over uh, 400 five-star reviews on Google backing up these class series that will help you to be able to pass the exam and learn the material. So again, check that out at insuranceexamqueen.com. So let's jump in to who is the commissioner or the director of insurance for the insurance exam. So uh, this is actually a test question that the, the insurance is run by the state. So insurance is not a federal thing. It's not, it's not a president thing. It's not a Congress thing. It is a state run thing. So insurance is handled by each individual state. In that state, there is a department of insurance, and sometimes they go by different names, but it's mostly the department of insurance. And there is a person who is in charge of the department of insurance. And this person is known typically as either a commissioner, a director, or superintendent, most common name being commissioners, because there's actually also when all of the commissioners get together, because, you know, they meet up with each other since they're all this, they have all the same job within their state and they help each other with making laws across all of the 50 states. They call themselves the NAIC, National Association of Insurance Commissioners. Now, their job, their number one job, test question, protect the public. The reason that the Department of Insurance exists, the reason that the commissioner does everything that they do is to protect the public. They're not protecting insurance companies or insurance agents. They're protecting the public from bad insurance companies and bad insurance agents. So that is that is the main job of the commissioner and the director is protecting the public from bad insurance companies or bad insurance agents. And this is why they do everything that they do. So they are in charge of all insurance laws in your state. It's kind of easier to think of the commissioner as like the police or president of insurance in your state. They enforce the insurance laws. They hold hearings. If people like if, if you are accused of, of doing something incorrectly, they can take you to court, hold a hearing to see if you um, have done anything wrong. Um, they can revoke or suspend an insurance agent's license. They determine all the licensing rules. So every state has different rules about who can get licensed and how long your license is good for and how many hours of continuing education you have to do. And the insurance commissioner is the one who determines uh, all of that. Um, so they determine the rules for licensing. Now, um, additionally, they also determine which insurance companies are allowed to be authorized and admitted to sell insurance and which ones are not admitted. So if you're an insurance company and you want to start selling in the state, you have to go to the Department of Insurance and say, I want to sell here. And if the commissioner or director says, yes, you're allowed to sell here, then the insurance company becomes admitted and authorized. And so it is the commissioner's decision as to which companies are allowed to come in. And one of the biggest roles of the commissioner is examinations. So examinations of insurance companies. So every so often, and it's generally five years, insurance companies need to undergo an examination to make sure that basically they're just on the up and up, that they're doing what they need to do. States can vary between three to five years is what I've seen, but the most common answer is five years. And the purpose of these examinations is to check their finances, make sure that you know they're not committing fraud, make sure that they're keeping records of all the policies that they've sold, um, keeping records of uh, who's working for them and things like that. It's basically just, we are examining all of your records. We're looking at you as a business 
to make sure that you're doing everything correctly, that you're not hurting the public and that you have more than enough money to be able to do that. And that's solvent and insolvent. And that'll be another video that you're going to want to check out. So this is the, the main summary of the the commissioner the director of insurance in your state now every state has different laws your commissioner may be elected by the people or they may be appointed by the governor usually if they're appointed by the governor or elected they'll follow the same like four year term however long the governor has things like that for your state you do want to read up on how your commissioner does come into office and remember that for your state exam. Uh, so find out, are they elected? Are they um, appointed by the governor? How long their term is? And then some states also say that the commissioner has to buy a bond, basically a promise, uh, a chunk of money that if they end up messing up or failing at the job, this money would pay out to the state if the commissioner or the director were to do something wrong or bad or whatever. That's pretty, I haven't seen that a ton of times, but That'll help explain it if you've if you've seen that in your state approved course text, uh, what that means. So yeah, that is the, the main job of the commissioner, protect the public, determines all the rules for licensing, enforce insurance laws, revoke insurance license if people are not doing what they're supposed to do, determine which companies are allowed to be admitted and authorized, and um, examinations for insurance companies. So double check your state approved course text, whatever course you have, whether that's Excel, ExamFX, Kaplan, ADBank, or whatever, they should have state-specific texts for you to know what exactly your commissioner and director does, but this was a great summary for you. Again, make sure to, to like the video, subscribe to the YouTube channel. It really helps me out as a YouTube creator. And if you were to drop a comment about what state you're in and what exam you are taking, so if you're Montana Life and Health, drop that in the comment. Florida property and casualty, drop that in the comment and I will explain to you what is important and how I can help you pass your exam with ease and confidence. So this is Melissa, your insurance exam queen. I am sending you all the loves, all the vibes to pass the exam. Have an amazing day.